Whistleblowing Policy in Nigeria Whistleblowing Policy in Nigeria is an anti-corruption program that encourages people to voluntarily disclose information about fraud, bribery, looted government funds, financial misconduct, government assets, and any other form of corruption or theft to the Nigeria's Federal Ministry of Finance. A whistleblower who provides information about any financial mismanagement or tip about any stolen funds to the ministry's portal is rewarded or entitled to 2.5% 5% percentage from the recovered funds by the Nigeria government. The policy was launched on December 21, 2016 by Nigeria's federal government and facilitated through the Federal Ministry of Finance. Funds recovered through the whistleblowing policy. It was reported that within the first two months of the whistleblowing policy in Nigeria that Nigeria's federal government recovered over $178 million that was stolen from the government. By June 5, 2017, Federal Ministry of Finance received a total of 2150 tips from the public. 128 tips came through the website of the ministry, 1192 was through phone calls, 540 through SMS and 290 through email to the ministry. By July slash August 2017, a total of 5,000 tips was received. In October 2017, the acting chairman of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission F. Ibrahim Moku said that M527,643,553,200 $242,747, GBP 21,222,890 and Euro 547,730 was recovered since the policy was launched. A Koi Whistleblower in 2017, a whistleblower helped the Nigeria government to recover $43.05 million, GBP 27,823.2 million at No. 16 Osborne Road, Akoi, Lagos, Nigeria. It was also reported that the Federal Ministry of Finance paid the whistleblower the sum of M421 million. Whistleblower Protection To protect whistleblowers, civil society organizations have been engaged in a number of advocacy to ensure that people who blow a whistle are protected. MacArthur Foundation is currently funding African Centre for Media and Information Literacy Africa to launch a whistleblower campaign known as Corruption Anonymous. Criticism Health advocates have urged Nigeria government to use the recovered funds to fund immunisation and other health issues in Nigeria.